Hello everyone, I'm Kathleen Alcala. Welcome to my channel. Today I want to make a really quick little video on making ephemera for a seaside journal that I'm going to be working on. I've been collecting things for quite a while, probably a year, just now and again, just finding things and collecting it. I wanted to make something with these beautiful images. And I have these old paper. And then I found this, this was a fabric swatch that I did, um, it was a swap with somebody and I thought this was so pretty. I thought maybe I could incorporate that. So let's go ahead. I'm gonna go ahead and start with this one. I think it's really cute. Now I got these images from redleadpaperworks.com. They sell a lot of rubber stamps and they do have paper images like this. I think I don't, I know I didn't buy this. I'm pretty sure that they gifted this to me. Usually when you buy um, something from them, they give you something like this, some sort of something um, as a thank you, which is really nice. And uh, anyway, so I just wanted to let you know that's where I got it from. How's everyone today? For me, it's evening time, so it's very unusual for me to be filming at this hour but I am taking off to go help out my sister uh, uh, just out of town. So I wanted to make a little video um, before I left. I just finished packing. Isn't that cute? I love that little image. What I thought about, let me move that. I happen to have this from a packaging. I thought it was just really cute. I just pictured this being decorated for a little pocket and um, I want to kind of try to just cut some of this out. I think it's just really adorable. I wonder what it would be like to cut. I'm just going to go for it, guys. As if it was a snippet. Look how pretty that is. Isn't that pretty all on its own? I think that's really nice. I like that. I'm not sure if it actually goes with that. I might save that. I have a lot of um, other things I can use instead of that. I just wasn't sure. So let me try. I like the colorful things here. Mm, let's go with this color right here. So cutting out a little label. I don't know where these labels came from. I'm, I apologize for that. Let me go ahead and just trim this up really quick. I'm not a perfectionist, so I know it's not even, but I'm okay with that. I'm okay. I'm leaving a little white border on it just in case. I'm not sure if I need that, but I want to um, leave it instead of just cutting it right flush to the image. Let's move on that way. All right, let's see. Where'd my image go? Isn't that cute? I love that. I feel like it needs a little bit of something. I have this. Hold on. I also have some of this. I'm thinking to rip piece off. What do you guys think? Kind of like that. And I think I like it underneath. I also have even look at the C trim, which would be cute. Let's see what that would look like. Oh yeah, that's so much better, right? I like that. Really cute. I'm gonna use that. Let's cut it to here. 
this is my first working on my journal. I wanted to get some images down. This happened to just sort of come to surface in my stash of things as I was packing for my trip. I'm taking a lot of my supplies. Um, how cute. I like that. This is so shiny. I don't know if it's coming out shiny to you guys too. Let me see what else I have. All right, let me show the images I have. There's these images. Isn't that cute? Adorable, huh? Look at that. And this one. Let's see what else there is. It's kind of sad looking. I guess that's going to be the best right there. Let's try it. I want to put definitely something up here. I do have some really pretty lace too. Like this. Look at that. Could cover it all together. I don't like that because I don't like what it says. The clue of the broken wing. Mm-mm. Not a fan. <laughs> what if I was to do a little bit of this? Let's go ahead and try this. Get that white off the paper. So how's everybody doing today? It's, I'm in California, so um, I'm listening outside to the sounds and it is about to rain and it feels like a storm is brewing. Um, there's always, I don't know, there's like electricity, like an, ex, I don't know if it's an excitement or an anxiety when there's a storm brewing like this. The wind is just whipping out there and of course I always feel bad for thinking of all the homeless people so I'm always praying for the homeless or people don't have anywhere to live it'd be horrible right okay let's glue this down so I am taking a week and a half off from work I left my work phone on the desk it shut off I handed over my keys, big old bundle of keys. <laughs> so my lead um, is going to um, sit in for me as I'm training him anyway to replace me. He um, was happy to do it. And uh, hopefully everything will go good for him and he won't have any problems. I'm going to turn this into a pocket. So I'm just going to put a little glue right here. This paper is really fragile because it is really old. Just giving you a heads up when you're working with fragile paper like that. So I'm wondering if that white is not such a great idea. I wonder if maybe I should get rid of that white on there. The only problem I have about getting rid of the white is because in my mind I pictured, you know, ocean is white and blue. So I don't necessarily want to get rid of all the white, but I think a little bit like that's okay. There's such a glare for me. Ugh. I wonder if you guys are seeing that glare too. Is that really dark for you guys? Can you even see? Yeah, that's really dark, ain't it? <laughs> okay, let me put it back. I'm trying to adjust the light. Okay, I'm going to keep going on. So let's put this down. Actually, I'm wondering. No, let's go ahead. Let's just put this guy down. So it was so weird to walk out of where I work, shut the door, and not have keys to my office and my phone. And it's very, very weird. Um, 
it feels liberating. It almost feels like I don't work there anymore. <laughs> I know I still do, but it just feels that way. And the job that I just thought I was gonna get fell through. So that was a bit of a disappointment, but I really do believe God has plans for everything. And if that job didn't make, come through, there's a reason. And I'm trusting that God has a plan for my life. And if that wasn't it, then that wasn't it. Look at, there's a, um, I wonder if I can get that on. Look at, uh, probably not. It's pretty glued in there. Oopsie, hold on guys. I'm a weakling, but I don't want to break it either. Nope. So we're going to have a magnet. Magnet on there. And put it this way. Because of the drop right there from the fabric. Okay. That's cute. Can you guys see that? Pretty, huh? Simple, pretty. But I want to see one more thing. I know this is a paper lace. I kind of like that idea. Hold on, I just want to see something. You're putting something in it. Like a tag would be cute in there, right? Simple, cute. I might put a little swatch of fabric. A lace right there. Wouldn't that be cute? Just a little swatch. Just a little something, something. I gotta have my lace on there. Let's put that on there. Mm. Let's just put one right, right here. Yeah, I hate the strings on the glue. So today was a day of running around. Oh my god went to Costco which was crowded oh my gosh it's a bummer going to Costco on a Friday I'm filming this on Friday you guys will probably not see it until Saturday or Sunday um there just a little hint of lace it'd be cute but oh wouldn't that be cute a little blue bow right there I don't think I have any blue, any blue, gosh, a little, a satin ribbon would be a, just adorable there. Picture a little satin ribbon. Wouldn't that be cute right there? That dark navy? Yeah. I love that idea. No. It needs to be a, a little bow. I do have, everything's going to come tumbling down, watch. I do have this. Now I'm worried if I cut this, is this thing going to fall apart? See what I'm saying? How it's, it's not really stitched, it's just tied. Huh. Well, I'm going to have to chance it because I really want a piece of this. Let's see if I can. I'm just going to glue this haphazardly on. It kind of lost its shape, but I think if I just, let's move this out of the way. I think if I just glue this on, there'll be the hint of the, this, the netting, and that's good enough for me. Isn't that cute? I like that a lot. Very cute. I think the rain may have started. It's just a windstorm out there right now. Okay. There's that. I love that. Okay. I'm going to do one more. 
I have this. I'm trying to think what I want to do. What should we do with this? Let's do different. Let's cut this little girl out. Let's add. Or this one is adorable right here. Isn't that cute? I love that. This would be cute, kind of the whole thing, wouldn't it? Let me see what it would look like. Let's just cut this. Sorry if I'm out of the camera. I get into my what I'm doing and forget myself. That's really cute. Let me cut this. I like this black and the gray, and with this color, I think that looks really neat. Um, I have these I thought are pretty cool. Kind of big for it though. Let's not use that. I have some buttons. Buttons. Isn't that cute? That's an adorable button. Totally cute. Love that. Really cute. No, I think I like it like that. Let me get... Let me find a little bit of some kind of a lace or something, something pretty. I like this idea of a net. That's really cute. I had three buttons on there. That's cute. Let's see if I was to bring this up. Make it like this. Let's go ahead and put that button back. Isn't that cute? I like the idea that this looks like netting and I want to go ahead and use that. I'm going to go ahead and just throw down a little bit of glue. See how that knit? I love that. I think it'd be really cute with this piece. I think it was a, it was a piece of a collar or half of a collar, I guess. And I like that. I'm just going to put it down. Okay, let's cut this. And then I'll use this for something else. Right? No wasting. Don't worry. <laughs> I'm not going to waste that. Mm 
No. I think this button is so cute. It's got to be on its own. Love the button. Maybe I should use some of this at the seaside. I think I'm just going to cut those words at the seaside. Isn't that cute? I like that. I'm keeping that, guys. I just think that's adorable. At the seaside. Okay, let's glue that on. And then I'm going to glue this cute button on. Love that. I just think it's so cute. That's kind of cute right there, those buttons. Just like that. Love that. At the seaside. Isn't that sweet, guys? I love that. I think it's super sweet. Look at how simple that was. Love it. Love it. Okay. Sorry for my hand in the way. I'm going to move this out of the way. Put it over here with the other one. Okay, I want to do one more. Let us... <laughs> what could we do? I'm going to have my options here. Hmm. Let's go ahead and do this one. Little kids, huh? What do you have to say? Cute kids. I had this old paper. Doesn't that seem fitting? The eight time frame, probably 1916. This is probably turn of the century image. I kind of feel like it could go across the journal, keep it whole intact. What if I was to use some of this beautiful trim? Let me see what this would look like. No, I don't like it. I mean, it's beautiful, but I don't feel like that works. I love that though. That image with this is beautiful. Maybe it needs to be Ooh. Gorgeous, right? Love. Ooh, the wind's whipping out there in the rain. I don't know if you guys can hear it, probably not. I love that. That is beautiful. Okay. I don't know why I'd like the whole piece, all of it intact. Let's see. This is pretty. No. 
maybe one of these big anchors would work. Let's see. Introduce a little color into the journal. Because then you have like this. It has no color. That looks better, huh? Just keep it neutral. I think the beauty of the paper works. Let's go ahead. I'm going to glue this down. So, when I was cleaning, I discovered all these packs of <laughs> beautiful vintage papers and antiques and I'm like what in the world <laughs> I didn't even know I owned them I decided that I need to pull them out I want to use them what's the point of having them if I'm not going to use them and so going forward that's what I'm doing god that lace is beautiful isn't it just on its own like that it's gorgeous right pretty and I do like this on there I'm going to go ahead and glue it. I also have these old tickets that could be cute. Admit one. Do you think that works? I'm going to pull one apart and see. Do you think that works or no? It's kind of not really, not really, huh? I do have some really pretty, hold on, look at these postage stamps, aren't they gorgeous? Hold on, let me see. How about one stamp? Let's see what that would look like. Kind of like a little color in there. I like it. I'm going to do it. Pull them apart. They're gorgeous, these stamps. Don't know what they are. I can't really see. But I like them. I like the color. Isn't that cute? It's very fragile, this paper. So tomorrow on Saturday, it's supposed to rain pretty hard all day. I am taking my sister to an appointment tomorrow. It will be a freeway drive, so I'm praying that the weather will not be as bad as they're predicting, which would be nice. Isn't that cute? Could you not see that on a journal? I love that. I really do. I had this big ledger paper too sitting here. I contemplated. That would look cute too. Look at on ledger paper. I want to make a journal. I want to make it all vintage and old school looking. I think this would be really pretty. I like that. It's just, I'm going to keep it at that because I think, honestly, I think the paper because I love the old paper, stands on its own and should stand on its own. And the image is appropriate and the lace is beautiful. And just a couple of, I like that, just a couple of things. Let me move some of this stuff out of the way. I excuse my arm and my reach. I know I've got stuff everywhere. Hey, I don't want to throw that away. I can use it. <laughs> I can save all my stuff. <laughs> So this is the beginning of my seed journal. Did I show you how cute these are, you guys? Are they not the cutest things ever? I'm going to pull one out. Oh my gosh, isn't that cute? 
Look at it. <laughs> That's adorable. I love that. Love. And then it'd be cute to make a little tag to slip inside of there. Hold on. Hold the thought. Look at it. Is that cute? Cute. So these are my three things so far. This is the beginning of my seed journal. All right, you guys, thanks for joining me. I hope that this inspires you and you'll be making a seed journal yourself or a beach journal or is something to do with seashore. Um, I always think of June as sea time, so this will be really fun to work with. All right, you guys, excuse my uh, messy cracked space. <laughs> it's like an avalanche. Everything is just truly just falling across. All right, you guys, be blessed. Take care of yourself. Thank you so much. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for giving me a like. And I appreciate all your comments. It's really lovely to see. Thank you so much. God bless. Bye-bye.